Hello, everybody. This is Jack and that been over here about we getting ready for a new training. I kind of have prepared something unique. I think it will surprise you. Once you have seen it, you will say, ah, really? So yes, really. And I will also show you some proof. So the idea is to get results, to get results with emailing, to get results with prospecting, to get results with getting clients. And in order to get in contact with a prospect, you have to stand out. You have to stand out with an email ad, email super client. You have to stand out with a Google ad. You have to stand out with, with the email uh, copy. You have to stand out with the landing page. But what means really stand out? And actually, I found something what really works, how you can stand out. So today you're going to learn a step plan. It's kind of almost copy and paste step plan. So my name is Jack Hopman. I do a lot of Google ads and that is where I get my most knowledge for. Why I'm sharing ideas because I learned with Google ads how to make conversions. I did that 10 years back when I created websites and I became really good in putting the right elements on the website. And I tracked everything from keyword to calls. At some point, you know what works or doesn't work. And the thing that really makes a difference and what really almost lead to success is that you are the solution to the problem of a prospect. It sounds simple, correct? So you don't want to offer A if they need B. But in offer to offer A, you need to know, you need to get to know that they need A and not B. So how are you doing that? It's simple. You're going to study on it, what they really need. What they really need. So today you're going to learn how to write the highest performing email ever. And you might say, Jack, this uh, looks familiar with the Google Ads. Yes, it looks very familiar with the Google Ads. That is where I have this notice from. And I'm applying it to all my prospecting. And it works wonderful. So what you want to do is the mirror the visitor end goal. So in the Google Ad, you kind of now quickly see what I mean with the mirror the end goal is if they type in Google help with, with Agnes, most will do a super client or a headline dealing with Agnes. So you kind of think, okay, that is their problem. Yeah, they, they know what the problem is. They, they want to hear the solution. So the solution is kill Agnes once for all. So remember this, you want to mirror the visitor's end goal. You want to mirror the prospect end goal. You want to stand out in the crowd. So sell your car, or you can do a re repeat the question, sell your car today, or what he actually wants, he wants to have fixed the car. He wants to uh, uh, buy the car. So, marrow the prospect and goal. And then you stand out in, in the crowd. And then, of course, we also want to add an emotional element to it because Emotion attracts attention. So here it comes. We use chat CPT for what we really need and we're looking for. And, we, and I created a prompt. What are the top five reasons business owners need with their website? What are the top 20 reasons 
de top 20 reasons business owner niet met Google Ads. Wat are de top 20 reasons niet met social list posting? Wat are de top 20 reasons niet met whatever your service is? Make sense? So now I'm going to find out their problem. That is step number one. Step number two. Then Create 10 emails. Okay. So create 10 emails and mail the end goal. I may also be emotional because we just learned that uh, did work, correct? That I want super clients not repeating the question. I want the super line mail the end goal and also be emotional. Now, I did this. I did an extensive test. I don't know if you, you, you probably don't see all the details, but I did create 10 regular emails and I create 10 emotion emails. So I create 10 emails, 10 shepherd lines without, sorry, without this. So this is actually the tricky part. So I did 10 emails up line, the regular part, and I asked that the PPT to come with that shepherd lines, which I has also the shepherd line mails, the end goal, and maybe emotional. And I send them out. And then you will find out that most of the top subject lines got much more clicks than the uh, many more clicks than the ones who didn't have the emotional and the mail end goal. All the top shepherd line, all, almost all top separate line where from this category where we add the separate lines and end goal. So it worked. And then I sent the winner. And then you see that I really get high overs and I really get high clicks. So I get the winners. So those are all emotional and even specific. What do you guys think? Is it not wonderful that you can just get good subject lines and get good emails just before follow certain steps? Okay, so let me let me uh, log in. Try to log in and show you that I really did it. 50. And then I got here. This the, I really didn't, I, I really was doubting what would work. You guys see this? I really did this. <laughs> I, I would not recommend, but I, I kind of wanted to find out. I kind of wanted to, found, wanted to find out a strategy what works. So I did this. And I copied this in, in Google Doc. Check on here. What are the top 20 reasons business owners need? Oh, oh sorry. With the help. So which which service do you guys want to do me an example with? Enter any service you want. And I will run it in chat CPT. Plumber, which service? Email marketing. Okay. So. Giris, which service do you want to website design? What are the top, are the top 20 reasons a companies need plum being business owners need help with with uh, good converting. 
website. That is kind of the problem, huh? Leads. You can do leads. Leads is also good. I will do the next one, leads. The the widget really works for leads. Okay. Increase online presence, branding, showcase, call saving, target bargaining, enhance customer service, increase service, improve communication. Okay. Now, what are the keywords? What are the keywords? Plumbing. Business owners. You should search for Google and help. So now I'm getting specific to the keyword. Because I kind of want to focus on, on certain things. Okay. Plumbing website design, plumbing marketing, optimization, email marketing, marketing maintenance, hosting security. Good. So those are the keywords. Create an email separate line. Mail the end goal and may also be emotional. Create an email and email search line. I kind of wanted to focus on website design, huh? Great, then email separate lines for offering website design. The separate line may have the end goal and may also be emotional. Good. Transform your online presence with stunning new website design. Ready to push your business? Let us create your dream website. Get noticed online. Professional website design serves at your fingertips. Take your business to the next level with our expert website design. Say goodbye to dull website and hello to high conversions. New website awaits. Start generating more leads and sales today. Step up your online game with our top-notch website design. Don't let your bad website hold you back and that is build your online success story. Elevate your brand with custom website design and truly reflect your business. Discover the power of well-designed website and watch your business thrive. See, those are all good. Which is the best we have to test with AB split testing. But those are really good. Those will get opened. Guys, see this, how simple it is? So write a called email with above separate line ID, use local business name and website to make it personalized. I use those tokens. I think in San Diego, the company, let me, let me create an email and get the right tokens. Okay. Company, company name. Okay, we have company name. Prospect company. My first name, just your, my first name is just your name. I don't know, that, that, that doesn't make sense. So your name, you don't need as a token. Okay. Your name, your first name. Okay, I still I want that as a token because you can exchange it with your name. My last name. My company, so your company, agency, name. So you just replace it with your, and a prospect website, that's actually a good one. Okay. Prospect website is domain. And then your phone, your tracking phone number. 
from call CD, your tracking phone number. Okay, we have the merge fields. Okay, now copy this and put it in chat GPT. But why the called email to plumbers? Plumber companies to offer website design. Use above separate line as content ID and use those tokens. So here it comes. Okay. Hello. I hope this email finds you well. I always delete this. I think that is a standard thing. My name is your name, my last name, and I represent your agency, a website design specialist in creating high converting website for local business like yours. But this is already very good. I recently came across your website and noticed that I could benefit from professional redesign, a well-designed script of a business like yours to attract and retain customers, establish credibility, increase conversions. At now your agency name, we offer custom website design tailored to your meet the unique needs for each business you work with. We can create a stunning new website for that reflects your brand identity and helps you achieve your business goals. Here are just a few benefits. Professional, increase online, improve customers, more responsive and SEO. That's all what they, they like here. You can view a portfolio and learn more about for your website. So you go to your website, you put some links on it for demos. If you're interested in discussion, we can I refer your online present. Please reply to this email or give it a call a phone number. Thank you for your time and look forward to hearing from you soon. Done. <laughs> is, that, is, is that not simple nowadays? Hmm? Is that not cool, Gary? Yeah, this is very cool. So you have to follow the logic. Reasons, problems, Okay, but I look for Google. So now I'm going to really dig in the keyword and then I get the shepherd lines. And remember what I always say, you want the shepherd line before the email. And now based on the shepherd line ID, I write the email. This works. Yeah, but we are, <laughs> there's more. There's really more because you might get a conversion, the first email, but you might need to send a follow-up email. So we created, created, create three personal emails, create three professional shepherd clients for this email, assuming the business owner has not responded to the previous email. So that is the follow-up, is a follow-up email. Use the local business name and web URL to make it personal. Keep it not so many or did. Keep it in mind, there's a cold email and you need to gain trust. Use the following merge fields. So we need to use the first fields. Copy this. So you see what I'm doing here? Personal email, not responded yet. And I wanted to do it soft. I don't want to do hard prospecting. Email, so there, there becomes a follow-up email. So now company want to improve your online presence. So now are really going to customize the shepherd client. Want to improve your uh, custom website could confirm your business. Is your website letting you down? <laughs> you see the emotion, Gary, letting you down. This is emotional. So we need to do, who's the following? Please write me follow up email, okay? Now I want the email. Okay, please fast today. So I hope this email, I don't want that, I don't like that. 
I want you to follow up with an email. So I, it's a follow up on email. I sent you last week again your custom web design sales for you know these restaurants, but actually I didn't want restaurants for prospective plumber. Plumber. So this actually needs to be so so you you fill out you fill out your niche. Okay, so we need to change that to do plumbing company plumbing company okay save submit yeah here it starts again i hope you find one well. i really sent you an email regarding your custom website design and yourselves but i have it on back want to follow up to see you if you had questions if there's anything else we can do to assist you as a plumbing business, as a project where we have a game changer, attracting new customers and establish credibility online. At your company, we specialize in creating high converting websites for businesses like yours. And we would love the opportunity to help you transform your online presence. Our website design serves are fully customized to meet your unique business needs. And we offer expertise in SEO. Of course, you want to get found online. Feel free to visit our website or reply to the email or call. <laughs> yeah, this is a nice follow-up email. Nobody gets frustrated about that. But we are not done, Gary. We are not done. Create three professional service clients for this assume public still has no use the following field. Okay. Need to get this the merge field correct. And now we, we're going to prepare the third email. Company, we can help you online. Don't let the poor web affect your business. Let's work together to create high converting website. Those are all good. Please write the phone, assume prospect, prospect company hour. Has still not responded. Now is the third email. Okay. Plumbing company hour. Has still not responded. Good. Follow up on the transfer online business with our website design. So here we have the follow up. And we have the merge field. I want to follow up on my previous emails regarding your website design service, your agency. I understand that running a plumbing business can be very hectic and you may have missed my previous message. So this is really friendly. However, I believe our service could greatly benefit your business and I don't want you to miss out. We specialize in creating custom websites or local business like yours. Our website design is online visibility improved. So here, this is really nice. So what have we done in 50 minutes? In 50 minutes, we created a whole email funnel. You guys realize that? A whole email funnel. We created email number one, we created email number two, and we created email number three. Just simple following steps and those emails are very good now but wait there's more and now you're going to learn see something what you also not have seen before so i'm using the email part a lot within san diego because i sent uh, on a certain day i sent emails and I love this interface. I really love this interface. So what did we do? We implemented that interface, the good things in the interface, also in the autoresponder. So when you go to the autoresponder, you see now also this plus sign, plus sign, where you will see day one, day two, day three. And so, so it becomes much more logic to follow the autoresponder. So that is the new part. So 
if you have been struggling with the autosponder within Sand Eagle, the new interface will make it much easier. So you create an autosponder, give the name, Give the name, let's say plumbing. Plumbing website. Okay, your form email address. Select the list. Okay, just select any list. And then you can do contacts handling. That means you could move contacts, which open an email to another list you can copy contacts to an other uh, list. So that means move means it, it, it really goes from list one to list two. So if the outspawner is connected to list one, it will not get more emails anymore. So you have a list two with all the emails were opened and copy means uh, they still are list one and, and, and on list two. Then you can run only for new contacts. So if they this has already thousand contacts, you don't want to run the autosponder, or you run it for all the contacts. And move contacts to completion, move contacts to for click links for the link. Okay. But do next. And then you're going to create day one, day two. Okay. my website day one so add the email now we go to the first email so transform your website design okay enable a b split testing add more already Add more. So you enter all those subject lines. Then you copy the email. And then you have to update, of course, certain tokens. Okay. Hello, company. I always do Halle company owner. Okay, then you enter your mail, your email. So you get the thing, huh? First name, you update everything. Then you say, I want to I want to send out to day one. Okay, day one. Good. So day one is done with different separate clients. Now I can add the second email. What was the second email? This was the second email. Separate line, enable. And more. And more. Then the website. Okay, here I have also an email. Separate line, I mean. More company and then you copy this and then you make sure the tokens are up to date with your name and so now this is split testing so this so let's say i'm sending out not day two but i would probably say it now i probably would day five or so or day three probably day five and then i i want to make it as, as uh, it did of course, I want white email going away. So you have to go to through the email and update the content a little bit. The company owner. Okay. What I typically do is I highlight everything. Font family Arial 14. That's the font I like the best. And now day five. Save. So now you see day one, day five. Day one, day five. 
And I'll do another email, the last email that we prepared. I think there was the email correct. Yeah, there was a third email. And uh, we do this online. Enable split testing. And more. And more. Select that. Oh, here yeah, we still have one. Love it. So even with the autosponder, you can do A-B split testing. That is <laughs> not good. That is very good. Okay. And then drop it in the body. I do always control shift V. And then the company owner. Then you have to update the link and email and here the tracker link. Highlight everything. Font family Arial 14. Then let's send this. Yeah, five, nine or so. Okay. If you have a website, let's say this is your website. Jack Hopman, your website. And see where it asks for the click. Our website domain. Okay. Please take one. So this is, I would do click here, this URL, and then click here. So and then your tracking phone number from call CD, and then I would add the tracking link because I want to track if they click on my link and click on save. So now you have day one, day five, day nine. That's how you create the, can we show an image? Yeah, you can. You can do an image, but text, text really works, huh? but you can do images as well. Okay, value is required, okay. And then if you go back, you will see it. And you can make it active here. So now it's active. Okay. Now it will run. That's everything. And now when you click on the plus sign here, you will see when it's running day one, day five, day nine. And here all set how many sent, how many clicked, and how many unsubscribed. This will be the new interface. This I can follow. This is the same as with the email campaign, but now integrated in the autoresponder. I would not do an embed video in the email. I would just do a link to a video. And that, that video goes to a landing page, and that is where you do the conversion. Because not all the email clients can play video. Some can, but not all. So if they cannot, then kind of you're stuck. Then you have to show an image. But it's also okay. Uh, now, this is actually on the developer. It will get live this week. It's in beta. We are testing it tomorrow and the day after, but end of this week it will get live. But I kind of wanted to show you because I love it. I really love it. So what I, the goal of this meeting was that you learn how to write the emails, the shepherd lines, the emails and the series, and then how to enter them in San Diego. And when you go to list, list, you see, you see here, uh, request leads somewhere, request a list. Here you can ask for contacts for your, for your niche. Good. So the autosponder, we're still making improvements. We will implant also a dashboard and a quick start. 
But the autosponder is really nice. Now it makes sense. Yeah, now you don't need to be technical. Now the interface makes really sense. You just click the plus sign, same as with the email campaign, and you will see how things work. The, the list gets automatically cleaned. You don't need to clean by yourself. We have an, uh, we clean it always, always. Because if we ended up with a bad list, then uh, your email server is not good. Request is free. The list, the contact request is free. It's included in San Diego. And Autospotter is also included in San Diego. So it's not an add-on. Kelly asked, so you only have to clean emails that you upload from other sources. You, know, you can, but we clean them always. We clean them always. Does a list get cleaned each time it is run or just the first time? Yeah, there's a, that's depending on how, how long ago that the contact was uh, checked. So, and, and it depends on a, a couple of things, on your reputation and all kind of things. So it's not a straight yes or no. It does always get cleaned when you upload it, but it might also get checked later on. How many emails per day or more warm up? So it, it takes about three weeks that your email server get warmed up from, from scratch. Depending on if you have a bad list and they click a lot of spam, then it might take longer. Uh, Gary, for example, in the beginning, he has struggled a lot, but now uh, we uh, improved uh, San Diego so much. Uh, now it takes only a couple of weeks. So that's why with all those improvements, we said with all those improvements, now we call it San Diego version two. Yeah. Gerrit said, you have gone really deep in all your products, which is very nice and helpful. Your knowledge is incredible. God bless you. We have a good trainer in our life. Thank you. Thank you really much. Thank you. Uh, so is actually uh, the team. I'm just a middleman in many things. Now, I have to say, ChatGPT is my thing. Yeah, <laughs> I love ChatGPT. I use it for many things. But how San Diego works and uh, improvements as a, as a really in team uh, effort. Yeah. Correct, uh, Alfred. Yeah. Yeah, you're correct. Good. Will rewatch got late. Looks like great. I need. Yes. Yes, Victor. Follow the steps. So here is the. Is this the. Let's see. Let me do uh, brand it a little bit. Not Nothing wrong to brand it. For more training. See. Okay, God knows in which hand it falls. Okay. I just created that nice presentation and I know I wanted to uh, email application. Support. At jackhopman.com. Think that's enough. We can do it over the landing page another time. Share view copy link. 
Here's the link. I can put it in the chat. It is really a rush when you are set to, be, to create a campaign. Is it a rush? Not sure what you mean with rush. Now, chat CTPT is a thing when you ask the right question, you get the right answer. Okay, but to my knowledge, yeah, all the marketers watch this video too, and they go, they go to clone me, and they're going to share, share it as their invention. Okay, so if some, if another marketer speaks about Miro, they now they watch my training. They haven't that done by themselves. That is, that is like near me. All those marketers they speak about near me now, huh? And but they learn it from me. So that is you are you are one of the first one who learn all those all those questions and how you get the best results with ChatGPT and get the best results. You will stand out of the crowd because you know the only the only that many will watch my training. So maybe. 5% from all the internet marketers, local mess from the world, they watch my training. 95% they don't watch my training. So you will stand out in the crowd. They don't do those things. You have to be a Google Ads expert to come up with those ideas. That is where I get most my knowledge from. And then I sent emails by myself and I test things out. I always test. I always do split testing. I always track things. And a certain moment I see things working. And everything that works, I'm happy to share with you guys. Every Tuesday I share things that works. And you just copy and paste me. <laughs> Good. With that said, if I did not answer your question or you need my help, feel free to send me an email at support at jackhobbin.com. And I love to see you on the next training, next Tuesday, 8 p.m. EST. Thank you so much.